Hello guys, welcome to my channel. This is Uday Pandit and you are watching MEP Technical World. So in this video, we will learn about basically how to change the direction of the motor like clockwise or anti-clockwise means forward or reverse word. So before we start the session, I would like to request you if you are not yet subscribed my channel, please subscribe my channel and also hit the bell icon so you will get notification regarding my upcoming videos. So let's get started. So first let's discuss about induction motor. Okay. So basically how to change the direction of three phase induction motor. So this is the terminal block of terminal box of the three phase induction motor. So generally there are six terminals for each winding. So here if you these are the internally wind. So three phase winding over here. So let's make it a star connection so here we have sort all these terminal all this winding at one terminal and make it short means connect it together with the help of this strip now let's give the power supply so three phase power supply so here this is the r phase so here we have provided r then y then b so in this condition actually our motor rotates in forward direction means clockwise direction okay now if we want to change the direction of this motor in reverse wire what we have to do simply what we have to do simply we have to interchange the phase supply suppose here r as it is left it r as it is over here but here in these two terminal what we have to do just interchange to each other let's give the blue phase supply to this terminal so here we have connected blue phase over here and y to this one so here what we have done we have interchanged the b and y phase supply so now at this condition our motor will rotate in reverse word direction anti-clockwise okay so in this way we can change the direction of this three phase induction motor simply we can change the phase supply interchange the phase supply among anyone simply we can exchange the y over here and r over here in this condition also this motor will rotate in reverse wire direction so this will make actually with the help of forward and reverse motor starter dol starter panel with the help of the contactor so in this way we can reverse the direction of three phase motor now come to single phase induction motor basically how to change the direction of the single phase induction motor so here so here we have also suppose six terminal connector and it has a two winding one is a starting winding this is the starting winding and one is main winding or we can say running winding okay here we have a terminals so this is u1 and u2 and this is v1 and v2 so these are the terminal of this winding a starting winding and running winding. now to make the connection of this single phase induction matter what we have to do just make it short to make the common terminal so v1 and u1 and v1 here we have connected with the help of this strip so this is the terminal of one terminal of this starting winding and this is the one terminal of running winding so make it short to make the common terminal so at here we can give the neutral supplies so we have provided neutral supply to this terminal now come to capacitor as you know that single phase induction motor is not a self starting motor that's why we required capacitor to make it start so uh, what we have to do we have to just make the connection so take the one wire from this starting winding other ends which is u2 and then v2 from running winding and then we have provided phase supply to the running winding terminal so make sure we have to provide the phase supply at running winding terminal not to the 
starting winding terminal otherwise if we'll provide the connection towards the phase supply to this starting winding coil then it will be burnt that's why we have to make sure this phase supply has to provide it at this running winding terminal other end of the running winding terminal so in this condition if we give the power supply motor will rotate like this let's suppose forward direction or we can say clockwise direction now let's change the direction of this single phase induction motor so actually how we can do simply so this is the starting winding here we have a terminal u1 and u2 now as it is left the as it is power connection to this strip then neutral to this as it is simply what we have to do we have to interchange the only this terminal so this v2 terminal goes to this terminal and then this v1 goes to this terminal so simply what we have to do we have to v2 connect over this terminal so this v2 terminal this in of the running winding is connected over here and then v1 is connected over here so this v1 is connected over here simply rotate the terminals so exchange the running winding terminal so better to exchange with running winding terminals okay in simple way we can change the direction of single phase induction motor so now in this condition if we give the power supply to this motor terminal it will rotate like reverse wide direction so in this way this motor will rotate so here uh, suppose we have a winding like this so how many so this is the running winding and this is the starting winding so here we have a starting winding u1 and u2 then running winding v1 and v2 so how many terminal we have total four terminals so generally we have a terminal box like this so here we have a like winding like this and this one end of the wire coil will connected over here and another end of the starting coil is connected over here so this become u1 and u2 similarly over here here we have a winding and two end suppose this is the two end so one would be connected over here and one over here so this is v1 and this is v2 now this is for common supply terminal and this is for like supply phase supply terminal suppose and this is the capacitor now over here so in this condition let's make a connection so how can we do simply make it short make it common of both starting and one end of the running and one end of the starting and over here what we provided neutral now for capacitor connection so one end of this starting coil starting winding connected over here and another terminal of capacitor will connected over running winding now phase will provided only at running winding so in this condition what happened simply our motor will rotate suppose clockwise direction but if we have to change the direction of direction of the direction of the motor simply what we have to do so here we have a, as it is like terminal u and u2 don't uh, touch this one so only play with this one suppose here we have already given the neutral and phase over here and one connection like this so like this now here we have a terminal so disconnect from its terminal block and leave like this so now here we have a v1 and v2 so what we have to do so simply this v1 we have to connect over here in this in this terminal and this v2 will connect over here simply exchange it terminal one into on other end simply so in this way in this situation our motor will direct will change the will change the direction in reverse direction so in this way we can change the direction of the single phase induction motor only interchanging the terminal of the running winding okay so in this way we can change the direction 
so hope you guys understand about how to change the direction of single phase induction motor and three phase induction motors so thank you for watching this video so please like share comments and subscribe and also hit the bell icon so you'll get notification regarding my upcoming videos thank you very much see you again in next video